Well, I'm back. I suppose it's time to go chasing after the Colossus, which is probably going to take a bit longer, because this one's got, like... I want to say it's, like, seven floors deep at least. Like, it's a lot bigger than the last area, okay? Just a lot bigger. Well, we do have an improved bow now, so we do have that going for us. Of course, now there's a long range units as well coming after us, so that's always fun. Did you guys, like, get off my case? Seriously. Ugh. Well, no. Man, I'm glad I'm not the only archer around, but would you just go away? Like, there's not enough room in this dungeon for two archers, okay? Especially evil enemy archers. Like, no room. Okay. So how many bats are over there? Well, I'll take the healing drop. Then use this dumb corner to my advantage. Yep, you gotta punch the enemies sometimes for being stupid. Okay. What, are they getting paralyzed there or something? Okay, I can just casually shoot through that, huh? Well, no, I love how the wall's not really there. It's an invisible wall! Like an invisible portal. I can't believe I'm talking about Dino Thunder right now, but okay. Well, that was small but tense. Guess we gotta keep moving down. Well, if they're all this short, it'll be quick. Okay. Okay. Let's see, can I just casually take you guys out. Okay. I don't know where that archer's shooting. Who taught you how to aim? Man, you're trying to make me think of that one annoying enemy from not Cybermorph, well not enemy, uh, the talking head. Like, where did you learn to drive? Like, seriously, I've played that game before. It, it, it's annoying, though not as bad as James Rolfe makes it out to be. Because you can usually see the base of the mountain coming and dodge that stuff, but when you do hit, yeah, it's annoying to listen to. Like, it really is. I just assume he was playing bad on purpose or he wasn't paying attention to the ground. Though, to be fair, uh, who would want to? Should really have to be looking at the ground while playing a, f a flying game? Like, if I want to be on the ground, I go control a tank, right? Okay, a quick chicken. Okay, let's just eat that and apparently boost our stats. I assume we're not going to get lucky and find another one of those again, really, but hey. Ow. That hurt. Yeah, I'm kind of wishing I put a point into healing. I mean, it's slow, but it doesn't have to be a lot right now. Okay, I guess I go in the stats. And I'll put one point into healing. Just so we get at least a little healing going on. I'll extend my range by one. It's not going to help out a lot. Like, healing's pretty slow at first, so... As cool as a skill as it is, it's not very effective as you get to the very high levels. I mean, right now, you know, like, it's slowly gone up, but... It's barely noticeable, right? But if you got lots of patience, it's fine. Okay, let's snipe you. And sort of just torment this archer by staying out of its range. Okay, let's charge up an attack. And just take care of you. And take care of you. And get you two gone, because why not? Okay. Probably should use one of the healing drops anyway, because we got so many of them. 
Well, I guess I could have also used a herb. Okay, I want to put you there. You there. Okay. Yeah, that would use the item we got selected right now, which is the basic herb. If we use the um, other button. But since my health was full, I couldn't activate it. Oh, great. Wizards. Ugh. Because I definitely thought to myself, you know, one thing I want to deal with is a wizard. Screw you, wizard. Ugh. I'd call you a slizzard, but I don't think you're part of how Slytherin, darn it. Ugh. I don't really care for the House of Snakes too much. I hate Draco. My biggest disappointment with this series is that Draco didn't die at the end of it. He was asking for a Reducto Curse right between the eyes, man. J. Harrowland's like, no, he's gotta live. I'm like, kill him! Like, he's like the one ring, you know. Drop it into the fire! You must! Ugh. Well, that's off the trap at least. Um, I don't even know if that hurts the bats. I would assume they get immunity. They are air creatures, so why would they have to worry about the ground rising up to pierce them? At least that's what I would assume, but you know. Games can be really dumb about stuff like that every now and again. Like, those spikes rise up just high enough. Like, why? They really shouldn't. It seems like they just do. Okay, I can't shoot from that corner, huh? Okay. Well, since you're stuck, I'll just kill you. Stupid mummy. Oh, that one was freaking out. I love how the walls are only really there when the game feels like it. Like, is there a wall here? Maybe. Or maybe not. You never know. Okay, there's gotta be something back here. Okay. Just break you up. Oh, some bows and a leather hood, huh? Okay, so that one's on a time system, just doesn't pop up at random when you walk over it, huh? That's cool, I guess. Oh, I forgot to sign my stat points. Okay, um... Some more there. Get some more vitality going for us, obviously. Prove that accuracy, and then, you know, do that. I'll probably put the next point into ra not range, um, my bow so I can do bigger charge attacks, because for dealing with bosses, that's always a plus. You know? Like, in this situation, it gives you, uh, a lot more attacks for your, uh, buck. Ooh. It's almost too close to the edge there. What well, am I looking on items? Ah, uh, we're getting a bit crazy there. Let's uh, head back. So we can sell off the extra stuff, you know, and then come back where we were. That's why the uh, baby's waiting there for us. Okay, I don't have any use for that. It's too cheap. Sadly, I can't really do much with that stuff either. Oh, that leather armor is better than my current set, but just barely. Uh-huh. <laughs> Yeah, that's a plus three, huh? Still wasn't plus enough. Basic chain flail. Can't use it, though. Standard longsword. That would be a downgrade. I doubt the bandana's gonna be any good. Yeah, I'm still hoarding the plant. I'm not sure why. I'm just gonna get rid of the healing water. 
I don't really care what that is. Um, I suppose I should, but I'm just like, I can't be bothered. It's not a bow, so I don't want to really spend money on it and find out it sucks, you know? Okay, let's see. Is this an improvement? No, because we're going to lose the power up. Okay. Let's see. So we spent more on that than it's worth. How sad. It happens, though. Ooh, 8,000. <laughs> you gotta love when they show you spirits you can't even equip yet. Or bows. Yeah. Take me back, angel baby. Like, I need to return to the dungeon where I was. Well, we made it to level 5. I suppose having more power does help here, though. Okay, let you shoot, then move in range and take you out. Okay. Come on. Quick shot. Ooh, managed to dodge all those bullets. Uh, the fact we're shooting lightning, though, is really inconvenient when dealing with these electric bats. And I don't have a another bow equipped right now. I guess I should have kept the other one for a tactical advantage after all. Well, I can't do anything with that iron blade. And in most situations, the lightning wouldn't matter, but... Stupid bows just had to go and mess that up. Those bats, man. Sorry. Okay, a green vest, huh? Well, if we have enough raw power, it's not gonna really matter if we're only doing a little bit of damage. Well, if I find another cheap bow, I'm probably just gonna keep it for a little bit. Because it's better than, you know, doing this all day. Like, I hit, like, four times. And it didn't do anything, you know? Like, just go down and stay down, will you? That was a terrible shot. Seriously, who taught you how to aim? It wasn't Inuyasha, was it? Because he doesn't know how to use an arrow. You should have taken his magic sword lessons. He's much better with those. After all, he does wield a magic sword. Okay. Well, let's uh, stab the heck out of you guys. Might want to drop some of those herbs, darn it. Ugh. Come on. Go down, will you? Okay. A real big fireball there. Monument of Lightning, eh? Maybe I should have just left that behind. Any, uh, secret passages around here? Nope, apparently not. How lame. Okay. Great. This must be one of those, like, destroy all enemy rooms. I'm gonna wish I had a different bow. Okay. Yep. Really not a lot to this place. Just, you know, kill things lots. Okay.
Okay, is this gonna be a bow I can use? No, just another green vest. Ugh. Green's not really in this year, mother. At least not light green. I think it's like a puke green, you know? Like you had too many, you know, shamrock shakes or something. And it got to you. Ugh. Oddly specific example, but I never happened to me before. No, I, I ate too many Oreos one time and went on a bunch of carnival rides. That was what made me blow chunks. Went on like the fireballs, you know, going around these big circles and going upside down. Eventually it was it's just, just too much, though. Ironically, it was like 20 minutes after we left that I just ended up throwing up. Yep, def definitely a story worth telling in the middle of a game, right? Well, let's just keep fighting. Hmm. Uh, if only I had another bow for these bats, darn it. So much easier. Like, I could make this work with a high enough attack power, obviously. But, I don't know if I'm going to be able to find anything in here. No, it's a light spear. I don't want a spear, I want a bow. Do I look like a freaking spear thrower to you? Damn you, game. Keep throwing stuff in my face that I don't even want. Ugh. Is there a limit end to how the enemies we're gonna get hit with here? Like, gosh darn, I leveled up off all these guys. Okay. Just a little bit more, right? Just spam shots. Ugh. Jeez. I think we need like a thousand experience since the last level up. Because it says how long you know we've been fighting here. Those little 15s and stuff have really added up. Just because the sheer amount of enemies coming after us. Okay. We find near the end yet? Because that would be so nice. We can move on to other stuff. Okay. I wish we could better outrange the freaking sorcerers. Ooh, a purple mummy. Let's try and get its funk down. You know, after 2,000 years. Okay. Trying to attack me from behind the gate, huh? Well, it ain't gonna work for you. Because I can trick you out into, you know, doing something stupid like standing there, you know, freaking out, trying to figure out, do I want to go backwards or forwards? I don't know. Okay. I think we finally opened the door. Yeah. But the battles continue. Come on. Ugh. This is starting to get really tedious. Okay. Just fall already. Jeez. Just leave me be, will ya? Ugh, even Susie Q would have given up by now. Jeez, didn't they make a reference to that? What's next? I gotta talk about the movie? Based on the song? It's weird. Okay, two more strength. Hey, next time I'll put a bunch more points in dexterity. But floor seven, huh? Finally. Sorry, I think I was never gonna get here. Okay. 
Ugh, if I go back to town, I'm definitely gonna buy myself like a short bow I used against these guys. This, this is getting ridiculous. Like, just so many shots. Like, jeez. You ain't stinking up on me, on me, man. Cause I'm like the gingerbread man. I know. I got eyes in the back of my head. It's kind of creepy, but effectual. Okay, dodge that one. Probably should, you know, try and compete defensively though. Oh, the box is full. Oh, they. Let's uh, head back then, sell off the useless stuff, and then, you know, maybe buy a short bow or something. Because I'd really like to be satisfied with that. How am I? Not doing so hot. Okay, that's done for. So is that. Yeah, way beyond my ability. <laughs> See how we can't throw axes, that'd be kind of funny. What we got here? Oh, a light spear? Well, I don't care about it then, by default. It doesn't matter how good, I'm just gonna trash it. Okay, we'll sell off that. Ugh. Can I sell it its own items? Whatever. I don't really need to mess with that. As long as there's a cheat where you can basically sell the shop its own stuff, but... Honestly, I'd rather be too honorable for that than anything else. Like, even you know, if such a trick does work, you know, you probably shouldn't use it. If it's for a shitload of money. Okay, I'll just take this resist scroll and... Continue my efforts. Okay, that was nice. I like being able to defeat these guys quickly. I hate, you know, when things take forever. Ah, oh, man. Let's see. Well, gotta keep going. Okay. Come on. Gotta take you out if I can. Oh, okay. Just go away, would you? Ugh, such an annoyingly consistent pest. Just will not back off. And that ought to take care of it, right? Yeah, apparently those arrows aren't reaching me. Come on, just let me up close and personal, Blue. Um... Come on, seriously? They just won't stop. Ugh. Okay, I assume where I'm looking for is over here somewhere. Okay. Ow. Come on, don't screw up. I got a heal after all. The only way I know how. By wasting time. Okay. Just stay dead, will ya? Like, seriously, why are the undead keep rising from the grave in this area? It's a bloody pest. 
Like when the Colossus rises up, is it gonna be surrounded by all these corpses? What kind of machine raises the dead like that while it's building a giant robot? It makes no sense. Okay, try and keep the eyes open. Oh, I bet you're tired here. Okay. Well. Come on. Just let me at him. Come on. Ugh. Sorry, I give my head there a quick shake. Ugh. This representation of my annoyance. Well, it does look like the next area is going to be the boss room, thankfully. So we're probably going to call that quits after we get done with these two. Maybe. Anything else up here worth killing? Hopefully. Come on, just let me see it. Yeah, those 15s add up alright. Come on. Ugh. Jeez, I didn't even realize I'd walked into these guys. So I like I blinked for a second and I'm like, oh what's going on? Like, oh shoot, I'm surrounded by freaking ogres. Ugh. Crawl off your stinky og ogres game. I can't handle the smell, you're making me nauseous. Okay. Well, guess we'll go down this way. I think that basically does it tough for cleanup. Well, a bit longer than intended, but you know, that's just how it goes sometimes. Like, you get caught up in the moment and you just don't want to stop. It's like trying to eat just one potato chip. Like, it's near impossible. Well, that does it for this episode. Next time, we'll deal with the boss and probably go hunt down the ninja again. Until then, see ya.